In this video, you will learn how to install a ground rod. The ground wire makes it possible to dispose of default currents, in other words, when metallic masses accidentally become live. Before this electrical intervention, please turn off the power for the network concerned. When performing this operation, please turn off the general power supply. To install the ground rod, you will need a mallet, a pencil, a cutter, a level, a hammer, a shovel, a set of screwdrivers, a drill, a wire cutter, a socket wrench, a fork wrench, 16 mm squared grounding wires, an isolating strip, a ground rod, and a flexible shaft. This installation is carried out in five steps which we will explain. Step 1. Prepare the installation. 30 cm above the floor, find the site for the isolating strip and mounting brackets. Trace the trench location. Determine the site for the ground rod and its length. Dig a trench that is several dozen centimeters deep. Step 2. Install the ground rod. Hammer the rod into the ground with the mallet. The center of the ground connection must be about one meter deep. Only the head of the ground rod should be visible at the surface. Step three, install the isolating strip. The isolating strip isolates the internal ground system from the external ground system. Drill holes at the sites you have marked. Place the screw anchors for the strip and the mounting bracket. Strip in the mounting bracket. Screw in the mountain bracket. Screw in the strip. Step 4. Connect the rod. Position the sheath between the strip and the rod to measure it. Cut the sheath to the correct measurement. Insert the ground wire into the sheath. Unscrew the lower terminal of the strip with the socket wrench. Place the bare conductor into place and screw it back in. Position the sheath in the bracket and tighten the bracket. Cut the necessary length of the conductor to adjust it to the sheath. Unscrew the clamp ring of the ground rod. Put the stripped conductor in and tighten it. Use a wrench to tighten it as much as possible. Fill in the trench. Step 5. Connect the isolating strip. To connect the isolating strip to the electrical panel in the system, drill a hole above the strip. Unscrew the higher terminal of the strip. Put the green and yellow ground wire into position. Put the stripped end of the ground wire into the higher terminal of the strip. Screw the terminal back in. For the second part of this operation, Please watch the video, Ground Connection Part 2, How to Connect an Electrical Panel. Get a certified organization to verify the ground rod system. The system's ground resistance should not exceed 30 ohms. You now know how to install a ground rod.